Greetings, dear family. God bless you, and may his favor and graces be always upon you. Mother Claire began. The whole community woke up depressed and not wanting to get out of bed. Me too. I also was avoiding facing the day. Jesus, thank you for rescuing me. It certainly feels like a geomagnetic event, Lord. My love, your curiosity will never abate, but I still love you. What you are feeling and sensing is definitely tied to astronomical weather. There is very little you can do except pray for protection, and it will be forthcoming. Do you really think you will get the truth from an online service? Your body and mind will tell you more about what is happening than that. Just stay tuned into me, and you will know what is most important. It is safe to assume that radiation will continue to rise as the sun becomes more and more unstable and the earth continues to tilt. Stay in prayer, continuous prayer, as much as possible. Right now I need divine mercy prayers every single day, for there is much destruction taking place. The wars are like a game of cat and mouse. Much of it is being done to keep people on the edge of their seats and cause instability. The threat, of course, is very real, but there is much haggling and debate about the start. This is another reason why I continue to need you to say the chaplet. Please, Lord, undo this cloud of unknowing. They prayed and saw strings attached to my head and shoulders. You are under constant attack. Your best protection is constant prayer. But, of course, have others pray for you as well. I am here, Claire. I know how you feel, and a portion of this is for souls. You knew the last days on earth would be very difficult in trying. And here you are. Cling to me, beloved. Cling with all your heart and soul. In this place they cannot steal from you or disrupt our sweet interchanges. In this hour, my beloved ones, there is great need for perseverance. Pay no heed to how you feel. Walk right through that mask of confusion. Do what you know needs to be done and ignore this assault. So many are controlled by emotions and yet emotions are the easiest thing to control, and the enemy knows exactly how to impact your feelings to steer you in their direction. That is why constant prayer is so very necessary. The unbelief of one person can affect the whole community, so pray for those in your midst who are unbelieving. Lord, can you please protect us from the ones who doubt? That is what the helmet is for. I would like you to try and remember the helmet before these times. It will help you. Lord, please help me. It is a constant battle, my love, and when others are being tempted with unbelief, it is much, much worse. Waiting is so very hard, but you must wait. It cannot speed up the process. Your prayers may do as much, but still you must wait until mysteries are unraveled. I am pleased with your efforts to sing, even when the feelings are not there. That is especially effective before these times of listening. Your dreams also leave a residue in your mind and over your day. It is good to renounce them and pray against their lingering effects. My very dear ones here on the refuge, I know your struggles. I see your doubts and your valiant effort to overcome the lies of the enemy. 
you are battling far more forces aligned against you than you can even imagine. They really want to put an end to you all. They want you to give up and go back to the world, lead a normal life with all its perks and fancies. But you have done well to recognize what you are dealing with and ignore them. Your reward for persevering shall be very great. Things are so intense that just to stay in the saddle is a well done. And if you can continue to hope and hold on to the dreams I have given you, in due time they will be accomplished. Hold one another up. This is what your enemy hates, and this is why he is trying to divide you. Alone you stand little chance, but surrounded by one another you can plow right through the opposition. When you walk through the storm, keep your head held high and don't be afraid. And that was the end of his very encouraging message. There is a song titled, You'll Never Walk Alone, that has these very same lyrics. When you walk through the storm, keep your head held high and don't be afraid. We'll put a link below of this song. Enjoy, dear ones.